ever wondered what kind of equipment I use? Well, you guys will be sure. Let's just jump into it. Pretty simple setup. This is where all the magic happens. So let's just start with the microphone. I use the Rode mic and I got this from Amazon. So I have the cover on it just to take away some of the sound from outside. So once you take it off, this is how the microphone actually looks like. It comes without the cover and I secure it on my camera. I make sure it's really, really secured. So once it's secured, I make sure to plug in and turn on the camera because that's the most important thing. <laughs> it's not really the most important thing, but then I've made this mistake. So that's the first thing I do. I plug in my microphone and turn it on so I don't forget. So that is the first thing I do every time. Once that is done, I go ahead and turn on my camera. I use the Canon M50. If you want to see a video or review on this camera, click on the top right corner to watch that video. But this is my Canon M50. Once I turn it on, I adjust the settings to suit me, basically. I adjust the lightning, I change the iOS and increase some of the aperture. There's just so much details, but yeah, I increase the light or reduce the light as needed. It's pretty simple to use. I put my camera on top of my tripod. I got this tripod from Tudu years ago literally most of the items i have i've had them for years i haven't changed anything so it, it can become very long i can adjust that button not button that knob and pull it up and also open the legs and make it longer if i need to or make it shorter if i need to so that is my tripod i got this tripod for about 400 ghana cities and then we move on to light so now this is a DIY thing I did with Flowshop. <laughs> so it's a reflector. I bought the five in one reflector from an online shop here in Accra. And I've used a wire to adjust and hold the, the transparent reflector on my ring light. Just so it acts as a diffuser for the light and diffuses the light. So it's not too harsh on me. So once that is on, I just turn on my ring light. My ring light is the newer ring light, which I got years back as well. So my setup is really, really simple. And also I have a table right next to me where I can reach for the products that I need to use. I actually need to get a bigger table, honestly. So I have a mirror in front of me because the table has some drawers in there. I can pull them and take out whatever it is that I need to film. And then I have a chair right in front of it. So this is my background. Um, I change them as and when. So this is a typical filming day. I turn on my TV, play some music, and get into the mood to film. So I'm going to insert a clip of the final video of what I filmed that day. So this is how I create my videos. Let's just watch it.
that is pretty much my setup and i hope this shows you that you don't need so much use what you can like i always say i don't have a ton of equipment but i love the way my videos come out i hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and i'll see you in my next video make sure to subscribe thank you bye <laughs>